climate change is real. It's already impacting Indiana. Uh, it's changing the way that the farmers in our state think about when to plant and harvest their crops. It's changed uh, their thinking about what crops that they should grow. It's certainly changed weather patterns in a way that has been hard to predict in some cases and mostly uh, in a negative way for our long-term future. We've got to do our part far more aggressively uh, in contributing uh, to uh, reducing uh, the effects of climate change. And what that means primarily is moving as rapidly as possible towards renewable energy. And that means that the, over time and the shorter period, the better, we've got to stop burning coal. We know that the, the evolution towards uh, more natural gas is, is a first step. It's better than coal, but it's certainly not what we ultimately want, which is a system that allows us to take full advantage of the sun and of the wind. And the jobs that will be produced as we fully embrace the renewable energy sources are amazing. Those are high-tech jobs, many of them. Those jobs pay well. Uh, and we have to do everything we can in the interim to help the folks that are still working hard in the coal industry. Uh, those are people that uh, know that things are changing. Those are people that, that want to be a part of the new era. I know that we can do a good job in finding opportunities for them, hopefully, uh, in renewable energies, but if not there in other places, and that's what the state of Indiana should do as well. We need to protect our forests in the state of Indiana. We are blessed in parts of our state with wonderful, pristine forest areas. So that would be another issue that I'd focus on as governor. We want to make those forest areas available, not just because of what they do to help the environment, but because they're great recreational spots as well. We know in Indiana that there are spots of intense pollution that have been caused by irresponsible practices, mostly in the past uh, from companies that dumped their, their waste materials in ways that were improper uh, and in some cases illegal. Those are sites that need to be cleaned up. We are the number one state uh, for air pollution. Our current governor is not doing enough to address climate change. Uh, it hasn't been a priority. In a Myers administration, all of that will change. We'll address these issues effectively and aggressively, and we will move Indiana in a different direction. I put people first, not politics. I'm running because Hoosiers deserve better than good enough. So join me to fight for Indiana's future.